rifle I'll be using is my Remington 700 with a US Optics ST10 10 power fixed. Rounds are Hornaday 308 178 grain boat tail hollow points. These, by the way, are the very first shot was a clean cold bore. So this is a, a clean barrel all over again. So I don't mind doing three shot groups to, to refoul the barrel. So far, both are in the center in the white. Don't mess it up now. All right. That's more like it there. I like that rifle shooting well and the uh, optic is tracking well. No adjustments to my rifle. 200 yards. Let's see where that bullet drops on my target. The rifle is shooting good. Uh, one and three quarter inches, one and five eighth inches, sub minute. Yeah, less than two inches. Here's the old recalled X Mark Pro trigger. And it's replaced by the Timony Calvin Elite with the straight trigger there. And 65 inch pounds. And the rear too. These groups were shot with the Xmark Pro trigger at 100 yards using the Hornaday 178 grain boat tail hollow point match rounds. The group averaged 0 0.702 inches with the recalled old trigger. And just below that I have the 200 yard grouping. Center to center is 1.578 inches at 200 yards so pretty much three quarter minute groups this being my first time shooting this trigger we'll start off with some dry fire here dry fire shots second the first stage I can feel the wall and one pound squeeze. Very light, nice. First stage, feel the wall. One pound, very nice. Okay. Live rounds. First shots. Looks to be eleven o'clock in the red.
12 o'clock in the red. Check it out. Oh, wow. One, two, and three. I made corrections of going one minute down. Dead center. <laughs> right in the middle. About six o'clock. Same hole as the first one. There's shot one, shot two, shot three. Uh, the center's all beat out, so I'll probably, my last group, I'll aim at the bottom of the circle there. I want to get uh, three groups here so I can have something to, to compare it to from the previous target. I decided to shoot up here in this square, but here's shot number seven, number eight, and last one, number nine. Next one will be the 200 yard shot. Aim here, my bullets should impact within this circle here. Make sure my lens is open. 200 yards. No change in dope. I'm just going to aim for that red circle and let the bullet drop. Oop, wrong way. Very nice. Significantly better with this trigger here at 200 yards. Aim it there, no correction in the optic. Let the bullet drop, impacting that area there. Well, with the X Mark Pro trigger, the average was about 0 0.702 inches, three quarter inches, and 200 yards. It went to 1.5 inches at 200 yards. That's a 200 yard drop also. And here's the new target with the Timney Calvin Elite. Here's my first group here, 0.443, center to center. Second group, 0.571, center to center again. And here's my last group here, just aiming for the middle of this open area here. 0.513 inches for an average of 0.50 uh, shaved off about 0.2 inches uh, okay good fair enough 200 yards 0.668 inches center to center now that's a big difference there okay 100 200 let me try this one out Somebody may be thinking, what is he doing with this thing? This is from Lurcy's 3. It's one of the, the developer's inventions there. Um, I just added this myself to paintwork. Um, closed, halfway, and all the way open. So, halfway, open. So, I like it. I like it a lot. Uh, I have a video on it as well, so I'll 
I'll put the link down below.